We are in Dunstable at the Dunstable Leisure Centre where the Toki Aenda Nenyika show is currently in progress. There's been a lot of chaos and uh, a lot of fans are going out and the show is still on. I've got here with me Mr. Josh Chigwangwa. Yeah. Yes, Mr. Josh Chigwangwa has just stepped out of the show. Can you tell me what's going on inside Mr. Chigwangwa? Well, I think uh, there has been poor coordination from the organizers. Much could have been done. People are not quite, quite happy with the sound system. And uh, there are no refreshments. They've run out even before the uh, talkie was on the stage. So there really is a lot which has been done, which is letting the singer down. Okay. Yeah. Um, how many people would you say are inside the venue at the moment? Well, it's really packed, but people are expecting uh, a, a very good performance from the adversary which has been going on. But I think they need to do much, much more to give value to uh, okay. singers coming from Zimbabwe. Okay, and uh, what do you think about Lady Squander performance? Did you actually see her performing? Yeah, I saw about one or two songs she was performing. Yeah, the instruments, uh, I, I mean, the... Uh, equipment itself wasn't actually giving them good quality uh, uh, performance okay. in itself. And equipment is key to motivating people in a show as well. So there has to be a lot of investment. Stage works as well. I think there has to be, they need to move a step, a gear up as well. That's my opinion. Okay, so have you been dancing yourself? Well, not really. I think uh, because of the poor quality sound system, people need to be motivated. Into it. You can see people are just standing and half the time when you sang the second song, I think, do you want to go home? You could see the mood that people are really in a certain mood, yeah. Oh, okay. Um, all right. And um, will you be attending any future shows? I do. Uh, attend quite a lot of shows. I'm one of the assessors for the Zima Chivas Awards and we also look at performers, how they organize their shows, how even the artists from uh, Zimbabwe are doing because we also do international awards and things like that. Oh, that's great. Um, coming to Zima Chivas Awards, when are the awards taking place? Uh, May 7, Royal Kensington Garden in London and I tell you we are doing around the clock preparations. Just okay. gonna be dynamite. Wow. Have you sold the tickets already? Are the tickets sold the tickets out? Tickets are or? already on sale. You actually go online and book your seat. And so you when you go to the show you know where you're going to sit, you know your seat number. You don't have to crowd with anyone on the door. Okay, that's great. And, and um, the nominees are gonna be announced on Tuesday. Oh uh, so the press are also invited at the Royal Kensington Garden at uh, 5 p.m. Okay. Announcement, yeah. Okay, uh, besides the Zim Achievers, what else do you do in the UK? Uh, currently, I'm uh, contesting in the local elections. Uh, May 9, I'm one of the candidates for the Labour Party in Welling Garden City. And uh, I'm promoting a lot in terms of uh, black and ethnic minority uh, impact in the UK in terms of participating in local government issues. Okay, and uh, what are your chances of winning in these elections? They are very, very high. And uh, we already have a bus which we are using. We actually took it like from the way Obama did his own campaign. And we have learned a lot of other things which have incorporated and you can see that there is a lot of excitement going on. Okay, thank you very much, Mr. Josh Chigwangwa.